with a, another wig review and this wig was sent to me by sister wigs i meant from sister wigs so yeah this is the lace front swiss first of all this is um from bobby boss yes. and it's the lace front swiss lace it is in the style ml f127 quinn and i have it in a color 430 so this is what the card looks like and i've been eyeing I, I wouldn't even say that I have been eyeing this wig, but I've seen this wig on different websites. And the way the front looked and it got there, I was like, no. But when I looked at the picture, when I looked at the wig on the mannequin's head, it looked different from how the model is wearing it. So I just went off of how the wig looks on the mannequin. Usually I go off of how the wig looks on a mannequin because nine times out of ten that's how you will get the wig. So it just looked like the mannequin which wasn't too bad. I felt like I was still going to have to work with it which you got to work with this wig. So if you're not like really willing to work with this wig then don't even get it. Just like keep it moving. They do give you a good amount of lace parting space and the um part looks really good um i will say that the part did not look like this when i got it it was like really jacked up and really tight so you will have to pluck this um you will have to pluck the part another thing that i don't like about this wig is the fact that it comes as soft like that swiss lace so if you're not a fan of the soft lace then you probably want to pass on this wig um, especially when it comes to plucking the part you have to be very careful with plucking the part when you have the soft lace because it can rip very easily and that's what happened to me I got like a couple holes up in this part area but you can't really tell yeah yeah you can't really tell but it is a few small um, holes in the unit now this wig does not really tangle I mean shed that much but it does tangle an awful lot after i comb the curls out and everything like that the ends start to tangle i wouldn't say tangle really bad yeah. but it tangles um but yeah as far as like how the way it came it came how the stock card came as far as like what the curls look like that's how it was on the bottom so that's how it looked and I just brushed it out with my vent brush. I did have to go in with my Sharpie marker and darken the roots because they had the blonde going all the way up and I just was like not feeling it. On the card they do this have I mean they do have the model wearing this wig as a middle part. I do not advise you to wear this wig as a middle part when I say it looks crazy. I mean if you can fix it then that's fine but it looked crazy and y'all know I like my middle parts but it looked so bulky up in here and then it was just like all this bigness right here and then on the ends it just looked really thin so the best way to wear this wig is on the side which I like it. I like it a lot better now when I first tried this on and my sister was around she was like girl you look like you straight from the 70s because some kind of way it just like was falling in my face I can't explain it just looked a hot mess but I mean, like I said again, if you're willing to put in the work, um, this wig will turn out really bomb and glamorous. I do like how this wig looks now. Um, so yeah, as far as like um, the shine on this wig, it is it has like a natural shine. I don't think that you need to do anything to get rid of the shine. Um, it's not on. It's kind of on the silky side but it's not like really silky i feel like it has like some yakiness to it oh yeah and as far as my part i did add um pow I add, yeah i added powder to my part but not powder but like i hope y'all don't think i'm talking about like baby powder or anything like that but like um makeup like i added some loose powder I forget what it is. I'm going to so show you. This is the powder that I'm talking about. And it's the Studio Fix. I have it in the NC45. And yeah, I just add, I add this into my part. So it works out fine with me. 
Um, I'm not really a fan of adding anything into my pot, but lately I've been doing that. Um, but yeah, sometimes it just depends on how the pot looks. So yeah, this actually is like my second time doing this video over only because the first time it looked so jacked up y'all I was like I cannot like I'm really going to have to move it to the side and see and then my lipstick with this color it just I don't know it was a little off and I wasn't feeling it so yeah y'all know how I feel about recording two videos on the same wig I just be over it for real so yeah <laughs> any questions um as far as this unit is concerned um you can leave it in my comment section down below and i'll try to answer